we're back. That's Yay! No <laughs> back where we began. Colorful universe. Oh, you can go in higher. Yeah. So now you've gone full circle, by the way. You've gotten so big that you're tiny again. Haha. <laughs> tiny. You are oxygen, by the way. I can choke you, mother. <laughs> Yeah. You know that little wiggly thing in your eye? Oh god, it's <laughs> I become it. So this is one of those games where you either love it or you hate it. Yeah. You haven't even found all the audio logs yet. You haven't got all the things yet. Nope. So you're missing out on lots, of, lots and lots of content. I don't know if I want that sad content. <laughs> Looks like corn. What does that say? Wrote a poem about his life. That's depressing. Yay! So, uh, how do you like being oxygen? Very slow. You can become bigger. You can always become bigger. Infinitely. Ah. Here's the thing. You are now... That wiggly thing in your eye. <laughs> Then. Yay! Oh. Yep, now I'm back in this. You're a rock. I'm a rock. Got a rock in my Come on, my rock army. Now you're an avalanche. Now you're an avalanche. <gasps> a spearhead. Or I uh, slice you in half. What's over here? Shrooms. Those are poisonous. Yeah, I'm poisonous. Can you dance? Why to dance? Yep. Dancing mushrooms, beauty and the shrooms. And of that, back to work. I like the wind rockets. So it gets all wet, and it's fun to slide around. In. Another thing. We have this hostility to the external world because of the superstition, the myth, the absolutely unfounded theory that you yourself exist only inside your skin. Now, I want to propose another idea altogether. Billions of years ago, you were a big bang. But now you're a complicated human being. But so we define ourselves as being only that. If you think that you are only inside your skin, you define yourself as one very complicated little curly cue, way out on the edge of that explosion, way out in space and way out in time. 
And when then we cut ourselves off and don't feel that we are still the Big Bang. But you are. Depends how you define yourself. You are actually, if, if this is the way things started, if there was a Big Bang in the beginning, you're not something that is a result of the Big Bang. You're not something that is a sort of puppet on the end of the process. You are still the process. You are the Big Bang, the original force of the universe coming on as whoever you are. Force in nature. See, when I meet you, I see not just what you define yourself as, Mr. So-and-so, Miss So-and-so, Mrs. So-and-so. I see every one of you as the primordial energy of the universe Your coming spirit. on at me in this particular way. I know I'm that too. But we've learned to define ourselves as separate from it. This would make an interesting screensaver. It would. Just let it auto play. It just like, keeps hopping from thing to thing. Now we fly together as a beautiful reunion. Another bee is ready to be born, per se. Yeah. You're disgusting. <laughs> so that's how the birds and the bees do it. Yep. <laughs> now you know. All you have to do is dance. Yeah. Problem with disgusting then. Yeah. <laughs> Heavy air quotes. Dance. Yeah, dance. <laughs> There you go. Dirt is the cleanest stuff ever. Everyone knows that. But but dirt is dirty. Dirty, dirty, dirty. I tried living in the desert for a while. It was I'm glad to, because you would have became nothing. Yeah, right. That's why the desert's the desert, because everything just left. Yeah. <laughs> it it to Got blown away. Is grass one thing or a million things? I'm really not sure. I see it both ways. You take it both ways, don't you? you dirty, dirty grass. Yeah, dirty grass. Let's see. Yep. Oh, bees! Populating the earth. Oh, wherever we are. I'm not going to assume. <laughs> well, according to Mr. Narrator Guy, you're also the Big Bang, so you're... Yeah. Okay, time becomes something bigger. Ooh, what's that? How do you log? Because you have all the abilities right now. Oops. Too far. Too far. <laughs> now you've done. Yay! Hmm. I swear the ladybug was the golden thing. They move. If you take too long, it becomes something else. No. Oh. 
what I would call a kind of a basic problem we've got to go through first is to understand that there are no such things as things. That is to say, separate things. That that is only a way of talking. And if you can understand this, you're going to have no further problems. I once asked a group of high school children, what do you mean by a thing? And first of all, they gave me all sorts of synonyms. They said, it's an object, which is simply another word for a thing. It doesn't tell you anything about what you mean by a thing. Finally, a very smart girl who was in the group said, a thing is a noun. And she was quite right. A noun isn't a part of nature, it's a part of speech. Oh, it's like going to school all over again. The physical world. It's worse. There are no separate think. things in the physical world either. See, the physical world is wiggling. The clouds, mountains, trees, people, people are, wiggling. are all wiggling. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. And uh, only when human beings get working at things, they build buildings in straight lines and try and make out that the world isn't really wiggling. But here are we sitting in this room all built on straight <laughs> oh, that lines. Was impressive. One of us is as wiggly as all the <laughs> Told you. I warned you about this game. I was in a conversation with uh, my buddy, and we we'll talk about, oh, it's windy outside. No, it's not windy. The trees are dancing. They're dancing to the song of the earth. And now I'm playing this. Yeah. Now <laughs> it all makes sense now. I was right. He was trying to get birth out. <laughs> Ooh. I want to become whatever that is. Butterfly. Maybe I have to become something bigger. Listen to me, butterflies. <laughs> Probably. I think you're holding the wrong button. No, I don't want to descend. I should be okay. Nope. I spent my life trying to uh, scheme whatever I can from the soil. That was weird. <laughs> yeah. Swine. <laughs> One going. Now I have to use fire sword and shield being good on an adventure. Yeah. Hero four. <laughs> Except that me. Bang. <sighs> yes. This is going to be magnificent. Filthy things. <laughs> Hello, Rock. 
I don't have a problem with gorillas. I just prefer them being away from them. Sorry. How rude. Fine. We'll take our business elsewhere. <laughs> Maybe. Now you got it. Yeah. Good job. I got a pony. <laughs> Not bad. Yeah. Stampede! Because you pretty much hit on the core game plates, become other things, and just die. Okay. okay. Oh. Oh. You're now a banana. It's not how bananas work. at all. What type of monkey is that? You and me, little one, we're going to make another one. Some people in our cultures won't approve of this, but I do. <laughs> you know it works faster if you get more of it. Come to me, my monkeys of the land. <laughs> oh, I want to be a beautiful peacock. <laughs> your pea hen. Aw, it's fun. It's fun. <laughs> There's just birds actually move like that. <laughs> gross kind of do if you hit him. <laughs> I've seen this. <laughs> seen this once before. Uh, I don't think you're supposed to admit to that. <laughs> can never really tell how well I'm doing with this. Sometimes it feels like I'm on the right, on the right track. Other times I just feel swept around the place. I never. I might. Uh, I might never really know. <laughs> it's not written the same way that you would speak. No, it's not. And it gets you that way. Again, diamonds. Ooh, that bear. Is that bear! Mr. Fluffy King dancing around like a bear. Let's go find more of our kind. You're back there. Yay! Hmm. Well, so much for, uh, 
playing everything. Yeah. Here. Pick it up the next one. Okay. Are we going to play more everything after this, or would you like to try something else? Probably try something else. Okay. Well, goodbye for now. Goodbye. Say bye, Mr. Fluffy again. Bye bye. Just make the noise. He's saying, Robert. <laughs> <laughs>